Okay, dokie. Here we are playing the Flying Magnet Zone, I believe it was called. Yeah, by the number 1234567. And when he submitted the level to me, yeah, he mentioned that we can pick um, some different characters here. And yeah, I'm just gonna pick Bass because, yeah, yeah, lately I've just been feeling like playing with him. Even though I've said numerous times, he's one of my least favorite characters. But, you know, he's kind of been growing on me a little bit. Okay, so, yeah, if you had another character, you could go down that path instead. So, I might have missed something over there since I picked an easier character, especially since I get double up. Yeah, he's gonna be really broken. Ooh, actually, this here might be a best path only, <laughs> judging by these jumps here. Holy cow. And there's... No? Okay. Uh, I was gonna say there totally is something hidden here, but... Doesn't seem like it. And depending on how tough or how long the stage is, we might... Oh, well, I want that. Um, oh, how do we do this? Like that, I guess. Um, but yeah, we might um, redo the stage with Bass or Mega Man afterwards, just so that we get to see that other path. And I also reckon that we'll have more splits up ahead. Well, then again, the stage might just link up at the very end. Um, just whatever, we'll just have to see. And do we want that? I think we do. Hmm. Nice, okay. Yeah, I remember from playing that other stage that even if you jump twice, um, once you touch the magnet, you will get a third jump, regardless of how many times you have jumped before, so. Hey, you gotta try and keep that in mind when you play as bass. Hmm. Whoops. By the way, the stage looks really nice. Um, I have not pointed that out yet, but really I think it goes without saying, <laughs> almost. It's nice to have a bright stage here. We don't have very many bright stages, uh, although I do recollect um, the last stage we played from the number 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, um, you know, that Flashman level. Um, was it called Flashman stage number 2? Or his second stage? Uh, uh, yeah, that stage was, uh, was also rather bright and colorful, or well, you know, it had a very nice blue and grey tint to it, I, I don't know. <laughs> Just making conversation, I guess. Huh. I wonder if... Ah, crap. Oh, wait, I see. You need these things up here, if I can make the yum. Wow. That is harder than it looks. That's all I'm gonna say about that. Okay. Back here again. Uh, nice. And now... We're gonna try and do this just a little bit better. And I wonder, can we... Uh, that kind of worked. He was stopped by it there for a second, I think. Or maybe it was the Cossack platform that blocked uh, the shield attack there. Um, there we go. Yeah. That's how we do it. Now then... Hmm. Dude, this weapon is killing it! <laughs> so freaking strong. Oh, what? Is this one of those cases where you need to do a... Okay, I'm just gonna have to try it. Uh, like, I did a dash jump when I jumped up into the main tier. I wonder if I retain it. Yeah, you do retain it. Huh. 
Okay, well... That is a tricky jump nonetheless. Okay, back here. Or, well, you know, pretty much back again. Let's see now. Uh, how exactly are we going to do this? Hmm. Like this jump? Is it even possible? Maybe. It's gonna be really tight. You know, I wonder... Is it possible that... We need to use this weapon somehow? No. Like, can you spawn in blocks and... Prevent the Cossack platform from moving? Wow, that wasn't <laughs> efficient at all. Oh, you know what? Yeah, that's what you do. Ah. Okay, well, that makes more sense. Yeah, that makes much more sense, actually. Yeah, that's what you gotta do. You might be able to pull off that jump as well, but yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and do it that way. That was pretty tricky though, I completely forgot about that. Oh, wait... How... How do we... How do we do this? <laughs> I'm not sure. Hmm... Ah... Uh. Yeah, no, that's not gonna work. Let's try that. Am I missing something? Huh. I don't know. I mean, I could just do this and get out of here, but... That is not the regular way to beating this. Mm. Yeah, no, I, I'm kind of stumped here. Because, yeah. Huh. Or, wait, 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 wait. I'm gonna run out of energy, by the way. Um, ah, shoot. Oh. Uh. I'm just gonna go back up to the top again. And can we get out of here? Can we put a block down here? And will it stay there if I jump down is what I wonder. Oh no, no, it, it got rid of it. Okay, I know, you're not supposed to have that, no, it's confirmed now, and dude, I just realized something, uh, had I used the block once more? Oh, okay, no, I wouldn't have been stuck. Phew. Well, we're just gonna reset once more, and I will teleport ourselves back. And we have teleported back. Now, I'm still stuck here. Wait, do we do something with this? Mm, no. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I think I might just have to use the weapon. Um, I'm not so sure I'm gonna be figuring this one out on my on my uh, own volition here. Like, unless we're actually supposed to do this, but it definitely does look like you could access this somehow. But maybe you need to just have a slide from one of the other characters. Maybe they end up in here, but yeah, I'm just gonna pretend. <laughs> That that is the case, and move on. Because, yeah, I've been stuck there for a long time now. Oh, well, like five minutes, but, you know. Feels like a long time. <laughs> okay, and this might be the boss. So let's duke it out with Windman here and do a stage reset. You know what, can we... 
Yeah, let's just do this here. And they'll meet you back at the start in a sec. And we are back. Let's see here. I'm just gonna pick Proto Man. And we're gonna head back and see what all of that stuff was about there at the end in that puzzling elevator segment. Now it's gonna be interesting to see what that was all about. If I do end up there with Mega Man or Proto Man, uh... Oh, oh, I didn't see the... The maid there, but yeah, if we do end up having to do that room with one of these two characters, it's gonna be... Yeah. It's gonna be a puzzler, I'm sure, huh? since we can't rely on dash jumps. Damn it. Well, at least we don't take double damage. Um, oh, or maybe we do, huh? I think they only deal two damage otherwise. I might be wrong, though. And you know what? There might... Damn it, there might be something up there. Hold on, let me just hit retry. Gonna jump over here and check this out. Yep. Hmm. Very interesting stage, lots of different places to go. Oh, dude, yeah, it's definitely double damage. Huh? That does eight freaking damage just now. Well, thank you. I really needed it. Oh. Oh. <clears throat> what? Dude! What? <laughs> what the hell happened? Uh huh. Well. Hmm. Please don't do that again. Okay, dude. Dude, let's move on. Oh. Hmm. And you know what? I think. Yeah, I'm probably gonna reset from the checkpoint again here. If there is a... yeah, there is a checkpoint here. Um, should we reset again and try that other path? I think I am. I wanna see the bottom path here too. <laughs> Crunch? Yeah, very good looking stage once again. Looks quite neat. But okay, dude, I don't like that. And that was apparently <laughs> a trap. Huh. So yeah, we're just gonna have to... Oh, I see. You gotta press him twice here. There you go. Nice. <laughs> what a weird mechanic. Almost looks kind of like a glitch, and yeah, those Mega Man 5 dudes are quite annoying as Proto Man since his freaking Buster shoots slower than the regular Mega Man Buster. It is nice against the Mega Man 1 spiny enemies, but yeah, not so nice against other enemies. And. Holy crap, dude. That is one mean E tank. Well, I see what we have to do, though. Wow! Dude, I shouldn't have gone for it. That's, <laughs> that's so tricky. Really freaking tricky. Well, I'm just gonna jump back there. See you in a sec. And we are back, and I took two shots from those cannon dudes, so yeah, I'm quite hurt once again. Not too thrilled about it, going through this segment with this little health. N nice side shots. And I'm just gonna skip that this time. That is a tricky E-Tank. You gotta be very accurate with your movements there.
And hey, I think I'll be fine without it. Okay, well, now we're back here. Very nice that we get to cover a lot of this stage here. <laughs> and what a cool looking section this series too. So much neat stuff to look at and yeah, how do we get the... Oh, I think I see. We gotta... Yeah, we gotta use top spin here. On something. Wow, dude! Huh. <laughs> but we really do need that weapon, so I'm gonna keep trying. Here we go. No. He's, he got back already. Here, here we go. No. Dude. Ooh, just barely. What? Oh! <laughs> That was glitchy. Okay, now we just gotta make sure we don't die here, because, yeah, we're gonna have to re-get it each and every time. And I wonder what the point of that is. That segment. Oh, actually, you can just get inside there. Oh, well, not anymore, I can't. Well, if I die, I'll go for it. Actually, can we? Dude. I was wondering if we could stack blocks and get in there, but yeah, no, no, not, not quite. This kind of looks like we're jumping around on some... Oh, god. On some flying ships back there. Oh my god. You have to go very fast here. Oh, yo, yo, dude, that was a sneaky freaking magnet thing there. Oh, go, please. Oh, yo, yo, more magnets. Whoa, that was a crazy section. And the flames weren't too fast. Um, they were fast, but yeah, they still felt like you could manage them, you know, like on your first uh, run through there without picking without being overly difficult, so yeah, that was a... It was nicely balanced their difficult device, I think. Oh. And <clears throat> let's just try and beat this dude legit this time, and not sheep our way through him. I only did that because I knew <laughs> we would do the stage again, so yeah. And he's giving me a very nice pattern here. Of course, with Proto Man, Tornado Man here is very easy. Whoops. Even if you do take double damage. Unless he got you in this pit here, then he's actually a little bit awkward. <laughs> but yeah, the shield helps tremendously. But it was a very fun playthrough. Very cool stage, beautiful to look at. And some very cool um, platforming segments there, too. I especially like the flaming. Um, ascending part uh, on the Mega Man slash Proto Man path, yeah. Like, Bess had some cool shite too, but I didn't quite figure out what to do there, legit. Maybe maybe uh, you guys can spoil it for me. I, I wouldn't mind at all if you just told me how it's supposed to be done. Unless you're actually supposed to use the rocks or the you know, crates the way I did, but either way, I. Yeah. Hopefully you guys know what to do there if, if there is another solution, so yeah. I, I'm just gonna wrap it up, wrap it up with that. Um, thank you guys so very much for watching, and have a nice weekend.